Well, hello again, everyone. I want to <laughs> give you an update on the, on the cancer diagnosis, or di uh, yeah, whatever you call it, uh, diagnosis. I I asked the doctor that came in to see me just right before he kicked me out of the hospital today. Went in last night for a UTI, and uh, they uh, they gave me bukus and bunches of antibiotics, and then uh, that worked, and then uh, gave me some two prescriptions to take whenever I, I get here. I'm back here at the big city of Kingston right now. Uh, uh, just got here just a few moments ago but I asked that doctor if I did have cancer I said that was the first I'd ever heard of it uh, and I told him I said if I do I do and if I don't I don't you know I, it didn't make any one bit of a difference to me but anyway he said that my heart doctor is the one that said that I did have cancer. And he said that he didn't agree with that. He said that I didn't have cancer. So <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if I do. If I don't, I don't know. I, I don't, I, I, don't start me lying. Because I don't know. One doctor says I do, one says I don't. So I have no idea. But it's all right. One way or the other, it's going to be just fine. But I thought I'd better tell y'all what's going on. One doctor says I do have cancer, and one doctor says no. So, <laughs> so I don't know. I just don't know if I do or if I don't. Oh, goodness. Gotta love it. But anyway... I hope I can stay out of the hospital now. <laughs> I'm supposed to go to the nursing home next week. <laughs> and maybe, just maybe I can get there. Oh, goodness. Social worker was supposed to come by and see me today. And I didn't know how in the world I was going to tell her not to come. I didn't have her phone number, but... Just so happened she called, and I told her, no, don't come today, I'm in the hospital. And I told her I thought that I was going to get kicked out of there here after a while. Sure enough, I was, I was kicked out of there, and they got tired of looking at me, tired of putting up with me. <laughs> so, here I am. But anyway, I don't know, who knows? Only the Lord knows if I've got cancer or if I don't. But I mean, for me, it, it didn't matter to me one way or the other. If I did or if I didn't, you know, I don't. I, it just didn't, didn't upset me one bit if I did or if I didn't. So one says I do, one says I don't, so who knows. But it's going to be just fine. No big deal. And I hope everyone has a good day. And I love y'all. And I just thought I'd better tell you what I, I was told while I was in the hospital a while ago. But I sure like that VA hospital. That is the best hospital I have ever been in. And oh, I tell you, they... They have quality, I mean high quality restaurant food. Oh, good grief. All the time I've been there, today was the third time I couldn't eat everything that they fed me. Just had too much. Oh, my word, I was stuffed. Good grief, I was stuffed. <laughs> <laughs> I ate everything except for just a little bit of sweet potato. 
They had turkey and gravy and uh, collard greens. Oh, I love those. And roll apple pie. Oh, that apple pie was so good. And uh, had cranberry sauce. I don't. I don't care much about that, but I ate it. I ate every bit of it. The only thing I didn't eat was just a little bit of. I had just a little bit of sweet potato left. But I mean, I just could not hold it all. Good grief. I was, oh, goodness. I was stuffed. But I have never in my life had that kind of food in the hospital before. But wow. It sure was good, good munching. So anyway, I don't know if I got cancer, if I do or if I don't. I don't know. It doesn't matter one way or the other. But I hope everyone's having a good day. And if I don't talk to you anymore, I hope everyone has a good weekend. I love y'all. Bye.